Hello everyone. This is Mystic Goddess with your general reading. So today we're going to see what near future actions the person that is on your mind will be taking toward you during the month of December of 2021. This reading is for everyone of every zodiac sign, so feel free to switch the energies around as needed. All right, so I've meditated over the energy and I've shuffled the deck, so let's go ahead and get started. The overall energy of this person's near future actions toward you in the month of December is the Four of Wands. And we also have a soul connection. All right. So I feel as though this person, they're going to try to um, work things out with you. This person, they want to balance things out. They want harmony between the two of you. I also feel as though this person's going to be acknowledging the soul connection that they have to you. Okay, there may be their soul tie energy here. They feel as though the two of you, like your souls are tied, especially if you have met this person and the two of you have been intimate. Okay, but regardless, for some of you, this person may come in trying to offer you, offer you a relationship. Do be careful with this person because I feel as though their energy is a little dark and I feel like you bring harmony to them. So this person may try to attach to your energy, your light energy, okay? But yeah, at the bottom of the deck, we have I choose you. So for some of you, this person may have had a choice between you and someone else, okay? But they're wanting to choose you. So, yeah, at the top of the deck is harmony. This person wants to make harmony with you. So, yeah, um, when it comes to this person, they've been thinking a lot about you. They, um, for some, this person, when they come toward you with communication, they're going to try to come toward you from a different angle or a different perspective. You're going to notice that the way that they communicate with you is a little bit different, okay? Okay. They're trying to figure out a different way to move this relationship between the two of you forward. This person, um, they've been going through a lot. They also have a lot that they want to say to you. But at the same time, this person put you through a lot. Okay, they put you through a lot. So some of you have either ended things with this person or you're wanting to end things with them. If things did in between the two of you, they regret it. Okay, they think a lot about everything that they did wrong in this connection. I feel like this person also is trying their best to focus focus on work to keep from feeling um, their, their feelings, if you understand what I'm saying. Yeah, they've been focusing on work. This person is still hoping that you will be there. They feel like they lost their king of pentacles. Whether you're a male or a female, they just feel like you're someone very stable in their life, okay? Or you've been very stable in their life. I feel like you were very good to this person, okay? But some of you, this person hurt you very deeply. I feel like you were trying to make things work at one point in time, but this person, every time you would put in the energy of trying to make things work, they would end up hurting you. But they want to come back together with you, okay? For some of you, this person, they want to make peace with you. I do also feel as though um, if you haven't heard from this person as of lately, it's because they're in their head about how to come toward you or how to do things. Yeah, they're going to be communicating with you. In regards to having a new start or a new opportunity with you. For some of you, they may want sex. Okay? They may want like a sexual encounter. I feel like this person has run into some, some karma. It's almost like when it comes to them, every time they do you dirty, karma hits them. Okay? And they're realizing that. Hmm. They want to put an end to any um, drama or any fights between the two of you. Any conflict, they want, to, they want to put it to an end. They're hoping that everything turns out in their favor. They want to fight for, for a new beginning. For some of you, this person, um, they're thinking of the past very strongly or anything that they've done wrong to you. For some of you, that's why they're holding back. They know they, they need to apologize. And so instead of apologizing, they would rather hold back from you. That's sad.
Yeah, this person, you've been the most stable partner in their life, but I feel like they wouldn't tell you that. Like you've been there for them like no other, whether it was financially, whether it was just um, speaking life into this person or just being someone that they could always depend on. Yeah, they want to offer you a new start in love. They want to work things out so that two of you can be happy with each other. Okay. Now, for some of you, I feel like I feel like this person may have been hiding some things from you. Now, for some, if you feel like there was a third party involved, there was. Okay. If you feel like there was a third party involved, there was. But this person is choosing to take action to express their emotions to you. Hmm. Yeah, they're going to come in with some communication. But I feel like they're not going to tell you everything. So if you've been waiting for communication to come in, you're going to get it. For some of you, they've been waiting for you to communicate with them. They feel like you've been moving in silence. But some of you have turned your back because you're tired of giving to this connection. It may be a little one-sided. There's a very deep bond between the two of you, but this person can't be trusted. They're too sneaky. It's like whenever you start giving your attention to them, they start sneaking around. But they don't want anyone else to have your attention and they don't want anyone else giving you attention. Yeah, for some of you, this person has been very promiscuous as of lately. It's, they've been doing it to feed their ego. That's crazy. I also saw that in another reading I did today. They still have a lot of love for you. Okay. But see, for some of you, there's a third party coming in between the two of you. But they do want to come together. They want, to, they want you to feel stuck, like you can't move on from them. But see, you see this person as a burden. So for some of you, you're dropping this burden of a person. And for others of you, you you're either wanting to drop this person or you feel as though you need to drop them. Wow, that was a lot. Okay. So yeah, there's definitely soul tie energy here, though. This person feels tied to you. And they're going to be acting on this soul connection. Hmm. All right. Give me more messages, Holy Spirit, in regards to this person's near future actions toward my viewers. During the month of December of 2021, what near future actions will this person be taking toward my viewers? During December of 2021. Two more shuffles. Hmm. See, there's an offer. That card fell out. Oh, wow. So they're coming in with an offer. For some of you, it will be within a month from now. The nine of um, one. So I feel like even when they come in with this offer, you're going to be guarded because you don't want to be hurt. Okay. They're thinking a lot about good times that the two of you shared. OK, but some of you, um, if you've ended things with this person, you may not want to reconcile because you feel like things won't go anywhere. Hmm. But, yeah, I feel like you're going to have your guard up when it comes to this offer. You're protecting your heart. Give me more in regards to this person's near future actions toward my viewers during the month of. December of 2021. What near future actions will this person be taking toward my viewers? Thank you. Temperance. So for some of you, I feel like this person, they're trying to heal, but they're, they're not getting over you. For others of you, this person, they're going to try to balance things out with you, but I feel like the damage has been done. For some, the damage has been done. They want to stop you from healing and getting over them. Give me more in regards to this person's near future actions toward my viewers. Thank you. 
So we have the magician in reverse. So for some of you, this person may come in with some trickster energy. So um, no wonder you're going to be guarding yourself against this offer because I feel like it's a little manipulative. The magician in reverse is someone that will try to use... Like if you have a soft spot for them, they'll try to use that soft spot against them. Everything that this person knows about you, they'll try to use that to their advantage to get their way with you. Give me more in regards. Give me one more card in regards to this person's near future actions toward my viewers during the month of December of 2021. What near future actions will this person be taking toward my viewers by the spirit? Okay, so we have the Queen of Wands. And at the bottom of the deck, we have the star card. So I feel like this person, for some of you, they're going to be trying to, um, to reconcile with you. They're going to be showing you attention. I feel like they're going to go after, come after you because with the Queen of Wands, um, that type of energy is like the Queen of Wands go after, goes after what she wants. Very determined energy. So they're going to be determined to reconcile. They may become obsessive or you may see their possessive or obsessive ways. Okay. But yeah, I feel like this person, especially if you've been a little distant from them, they're going to try to um, get you addicted to them. They may try to do it through sex for some of you. For others of you, I feel like this person is going to try to stop your healing process if you've been healing from them. Give me more about um, this Knight of Pentacles for this person's near future actions in December. So for my viewers, thank you. See, they're stressing about you or stressing over you. They want to come toward you, but they, they're they a little worried if you, if you would accept what they have to offer. They feel like they may have taken too long or like you're just not interested. Why is this Nine of Swords here? Look. See? They feel this soul connection very heavy. But see, for some of you, this person has a lot of dark energy attached to them. It causes them burdens. Also, be careful about this person trying to put their burdens off on you. Because I feel like karma is kicking their butt. Okay? Especially through their money. It's because of the things that they've done to betray you. Everything is turning around on them. So, just make sure you use your intuition when it comes to making a judgment call on this person. Okay? Okay? Because for some of you, they have hidden motives in regards to why they're coming toward you in the first place. And they're not going to be telling you everything. Hmm. Why is the magician here in reverse? For this person's near future actions toward my viewers. Why is the magician in reverse? Thank you. The king of wands. And that came out crossing. So for some of you... um. Be careful of this person trying to, like, if you were to be intimate with them, they may try to use sex magic. But see, the King of Wands crossing is not a dependable person. This is someone that likes to chase. Like, they see they see you as a challenge, especially if you've been distant. They're, they're going to try to come in and dominate over you. Their feelings, they're a mess. They're within their emotions. Their emotions are all over the place. For some of you, um, this person, they may try to manipulate you on an emotional level. I feel like this person may end up having a breakdown, an emotional breakdown. They may have had one and just not letting you know about it. Hmm. They don't know if they'll be able to win you over. But they're going to pull out all of their tricks. But I feel like a lot of you know all their tricks because you can't teach an old dog new tricks, right? So I feel like for a lot of you, it's not going to work. Why is the four of wands here for this person's near future action toward my viewers? Why is the four of wands here? Thank you. See? The four of cups. They feel like... 
you may not be interested in their offer. If they're if they've been ignoring you, they've been watching you. For some of you, they'll try to make you think they're happy, but they're really not. Give me more about this Four of Cups for this person's near future actions toward my viewers. Whatever they have, whatever they come in trying to offer you, it's not going to satisfy you. For some of you, they may start an argument or drama to try and get your attention. But yeah, someone may, they may end up having like a mental breakdown or an emotional breakdown. Why is the Queen of Wands here for this person's near future actions toward my viewers? So they may um, come toward you in a passionate way. The Nine of Wands. Hmm. I feel like um, they're going to try to get you to let your guard down. Give me more about this Queen of Wands energy. For some of you, if they've been sneaking around, they're going to try to protect um, their secret or keep a secret guarded. Look at this. The Seven of Wands and that came out crossing. Some of you are going to catch this person up. That came out in my um, other reading for loosely involved and on and off. For some of you, you're going to find out why this person hasn't been, why they've been so detached as of lately. Or what they've been doing since they haven't been taking action toward you. You may find out some things. Why is the Seven of Swords here crossing? Something they did impulsively. You may find out about... Um, Someone that they haven't told you about that they're leaving behind to come toward you. Give me more about this Seven of Swords crossing. Hmm. Look at this. See, you're going to catch this person up. The Page of Cups. They're coming in with communication to make things right. So, yeah, you, you're going to catch this person up. Also, be careful about them coming toward you. Like I said, it's trying to start a fight with you. They could get real petty, but yeah, you're going to catch this person. You're going to catch them up. Hmm. All right. So that is the reading. Everyone, if you guys resonated with this or if you liked this reading, make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I would love to have you as a part of the Mystic family. I love each and every one of you guys so, so much. You take care. Be safe. Until next time, bye.